Hello and welcome back to Jupiter Hell. Um, yep, it's a it's an interesting run. I I think we could stand to like it's not necessarily a one run yet. There's good things about it for sure, but um, you know we we have a ways to go before I would consider it like infallible. Um, of course, nothing is infallible, but... Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and increase our health. That's going to give us some pain. Um, we do have three multi-tools. I could do that again. I think that's worth doing. Nice. That was a good set of turns. Okay, this is not so good. But again, I mean, like, I have to feel good about the fact that even in a bad situation like that, where we can't really, you know, I mean, I, I suppose I could have smoked and backed up if I wanted to. I suppose I should always do that in that situation. That is what the smoke is for, to basically turn a bad situation into a better one. Um... So this thing is frozen. We do have the ability to basically stun lock, which is nice. We don't have a great way of dealing with this turret. I guess that was a pretty good way of dealing with that turret. Um, I think I'm gonna forego the extra health by uh, paying one multi-tool for a heal. We might do a, a med kit That's later. Better. And maybe I uh, have wasted that, but I I don't think I don't think that's ever a waste. Also, we're fighting Medusas now. Good to know. The Medusa heads are you know late game, so we're 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 definitely dabbling in late game territory now. Nice. That Frozen is doing wonders for us. Unfortunately, it didn't stop them from attacking us, but damn, all the same. It was really excellent. Okay, let's um tab to the turret, because that's going to do damage to us right away. The other guy is going to take a second to, to get to us. That was a good set of turns, I think. We have close to 400 ammo. No room. The scavenger really is, I, I think, necessary for pretty much every run. I'd like to think that um, there are... There's no, like, correct ways to play this game, but I do think that there are certain things that are kind of necessary. All right. No room. All right. Um, let's drop something just for a moment. We'll pick it up again. And we're going to go ahead and put an accuracy mod on our combat armor, although our combat armor is taking some damage. But we, we can do it. So reduce dodge penalties, increase pain reduction per turn by 50%. I mean, sure. It's not great, but... It is something. Carry too much shit. So we have three frag grenades. We should start using frag grenades. They probably don't do a lot of damage. And like, maybe it's always gonna be worth using our, just our normal fire. So I am interested in this cry hyper, hyper blaster. I'm already, Using one apparently. Time for some high tech melting. No, I was using a cry rail rifle. No fucking room. Um so what does this guy do? Ten times four plasma. Spins up to fire plus two and plus four shots. 
I don't know. I'm not sure what that means for us. Could be good. I just don't know if anything's going to be as good as our hammerhead. Because our hammerhead has, like, pen. It, it, it fires through, like, everything. And it's really hard to beat that because it's ultimately it's going to be hurting things that we can't even see, you know. We're actually like clearing the floor. This is interesting. I'm, I'm hearing enemies over here, but I'm not seeing them. I'm not seeing any way to get over there even. Oh, wait a minute. There's a, a door up there that I haven't explored. Oh, that's right. We don't light barrels on fire anymore. This is this is a good thing. Dark cathedral. Um, well, I don't know what's up. This is a weird circumstance. I'm not I'm hearing monsters, but I don't know how to get to them. I'm wondering if there's a secret over here or something. I don't think I've ever experienced something like this in this game. Or I knew there was something, but I didn't know how to get to it. So I think I'm going to go for... I'm going to use another multi-tool for a heal. And we're going to go to the Dark Cathedral. I don't think there's necessarily any reason to go there. This place should have stayed buried. Turn back while you still can't. This this place sucks. It really does suck. But um, I think it will be worth it ultimately. They, they always scare me with this every time. There's basically a jump scare. Every single time they jump scare me with this. Oh God, every single time. I hate that. I hate that. Don't do that. I don't like that. Oh, we're using we're using our this different weapon that was not the hammerhead. We do have freeze resistance, so there should be one more. Your tenacity will be your doom. <sighs> I hate that. That jump scare, not a fan. I know it's not even intended to be a jump scare maybe, but it scares me every time. It's because they make this place like extra dark also. Also sucks that you can't just wait it because then I don't get my entrenchment. Level 15. Uh, we're taking quite a lot of damage right now. Do I want to take sustained fire? I think sustained fire three is what we want. I do think I want to take a, I'll take a combat pack. No, my headgear. So we're no longer getting uh, extra XP. Leave now, mortal, or, your, or you'll face 
the temple's true power. I mean, that's fine. I think I want to take another heal. I don't think I have another heal. It's just a sim pack. That's not good. Okay, I guess I'm going to use the stim pack. Um, not good. Taking some major damage. Fortunately, they're doing cry damage sometimes. I might have to bail on this because this is like not going well. Maybe I can't bail. Oh, don't tell me we're gonna die here. Short range teleporter. Recording the manual should move you to a safe place. We're alive. Yeah, this was a mistake coming down here. I have no heal. I wonder if I can leave. Leaving would give me a small amount of heal and then maybe I can survive. Inactive, okay. Oh, wait a minute. It sucks, but I have to do it. I'm probably still gonna die. Like, I only get 10 health back. But there's a small chance I can maybe pull things around. Died. Dead. Damn it. Yep. Oh, that sucks. Well, I tried my best. Maybe there were things I could do better. Um, probably just not using the smoke screen every time is what's getting me killed. Um, I I don't like the smoke screen. I don't I I don't like like. Smoking and then backing up is not a tactic that I, I don't know, enjoy or am used to doing. So I think that's the last time I try the te technician. Or if I do, then I'll have to tr try a, a, like a drone gimmick run. Um, but I don't think I want to, uh, I don't think I want to do the, the, uh, the technician again. I don't, I don't like them. I don't like that play style. Um, we have, I can't eat, like, it's been a while since I played the Marine or Scout. Scout, I remembered, was pretty interesting because they relied on, uh, I think, their dodge. Revealed the location of all the regular elevators, branch connections, and special elevator levels are still hidden. You only have two weapon slots. For 25 energy, you can activate stealth and go invisible for a few turns. I mean, this is, like, very similar to smoke in some ways. You gain plus 100% crit chance while stealth. I mean, the nice thing about that is you do get a damage bonus, right? It's got to start with a revolver and 44 ammo. And then 
For 30 points of fury, you may channel your adrenaline, heal a bit, convert one quarter of your pain modifier to health, and can protect yourself from pain for five seconds. I mean, that's a very, like, that's useful. Um, I can see myself, like, I, I, I probably, I, maybe I didn't use it as much as I should have when I played the Marine, but I can see myself, like, more likely to use it. I don't know, I still don't have a win with the technician and I would like one and I would like to try the drone gimmick run. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, all right, all right. What the hell happened here? At the very least, we're gonna do a drone gimmick run. Um, so that means we're gonna go for wizard. Summon a drone at cost of 30 power. Hacked enemies have over health. I don't know how to hack enemies. How does how does that work? What's what's hacker? Uh, you're the geek of the squad. You know your way around a failing letter. Screensaver is better than the average movie core. Reduces multi-tool cost of hacking. Reduction depends on task difficulty. Okay, I mean that's interesting. Um, yeah. Let's, so let's let's do that, and we're gonna we're gonna do a drone um, heavy run. I guess I should have. Smoke's there. There it is, our first not smoke. That was good, at least. See, the thing is that I don't like about the smoke is it's deb it's kind of debatably advantageous. Like, it's good for backing up and finding a better position. But then a couple of things happen. The enemy might not move up. Um, so that's just kind of tedious and annoying. Um, and also, they like, I also can't fire through smoke. So I also have to deal with the repercussions of smoke, which I'm not a huge fan of. I can do it here. So, that's the last time I complain about smoke, I promise. Um, and I'm not even, like, really complaining about smoke. It's more like... I don't know. I, um... Talking through why I'm not a huge fan of using it. Why I'm resistant to using it. So, we're gonna want to take Hacker. Um, does... What does Wizard require? Skilled one, hacker one. We want to take skilled one first, I guess. Because it does actually give us an, an advantage for dismantling. Dismantling is, I think, my favorite thing about uh, the technician, is that we get some mods back. But it's kind of a mid-game thing. I do like the shotgun, so I guess I will go shotgun again. And we're going to go ahead and heal up. Let's see how, how far we can get in like 12 minutes. I'm not gonna speed, don't worry. I'm not gonna be, you know, rash. Oh, oh wow. Early armor, nice. Um. I don't know if this is better. Okay, let's smoke. Reload, damn it. I'm gonna use our health kit. Not dead yet. Smoke might be like, maybe we, if I went like melee build with this character, smoke might be more interesting because then we could like smoke and then basically cut through everything Th there's there's something there i i could definitely see the blade master being a interesting or worthy build more firepower um you know considering that um cuz you can actually like you know kill things with the melee whoops Uh, 
Okay, this is bad. I'm gonna die, aren't I? Yeah, just move on to the next floor. Security should be here soon. <laughs> this is dumb. Died. That doesn't mean I'm gonna quit. I'm I'm just gonna try again. Technician. What the hell happened here? Okay. Do we, are we out of ammo? Oh, there's nothing left to kill. I don't think I'm going to go shotgun again this time. That's just to get their attention. Okay, again, we're going to go skilled, and I'm going to try and... If we could find an early... Oh, I guess we have. there's a knife there. We could try something. All right, let's try the knife. Even if we don't have, like, any kind of, like, weird gimmicks, like the, the wave bl blade or whatever, um, we could try and make smoke and knife work. Because maybe there's something there. Maybe that's how I should be using the knife. Good luck, you're gonna need it. Obviously, like, the smoke doesn't have infinite range. So, um, wait, did that say Mimir? To Mimir. Um, you know, the smoke doesn't have infinite range. It has a pretty big range, but, uh, we're gonna have, to, we're only gonna wanna use this in close quarters, like something like this. Oh, we could. Hack? Oh, this is where Hacker comes in handy. Okay. Shh. Well, no. I, I want to attack it. So that does work. And then we have to switch back to pistol. Okay. There's something there. Maybe, maybe I've had the wrong idea about... Um, The, uh, the technician this whole time. I've just been, like, playing them improperly. Oh. I'm willing to believe that. I mean, you know, that's always how it goes, right? It's like, it's not that it's harder, it's that you're playing them wrong. But interesting, I didn't know, or maybe I did know, but I forgot that you could hack, like, robots. So with the hacker ability, it reducing cost, um, smoke actually makes a lot more sense. Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to smoke here. Then I'm going to switch to our combat knife. Oh, okay. Come on in here. That's the only time you can attack, like, you can move diagonally, is if there's something diagonally. That worked out well. So, this is a legitimate tactic, I think. Do I want to go to the Badlands? The Mimir Habitat? I don't think so. I think, uh, I think we're good for now. This will be a mess. Oh, we've got... We're going to have barrels everywhere. That can be advantageous to, for us. Oh, we have the wrong weapon. There you go. Everything's easy when there's, like, 
just barrels everywhere. Hearing something. Okay, smoke. Combat knife. Level up. Okay, we're gonna want hacker. I'm pretty sure this may make um, hacking drones free. I think that uh, people are going to be a bit... I, I'm surprised I haven't had too many, like, angry comments talking about how I don't use smoke properly. And uh, I, I hope that this will make those um, people happy. But I haven't really gotten any comments about my play in terms of... of well, okay, you, you know who you are. You Like, I, I get the helpful advice for sure. But I haven't gotten any angry replies, which I appreciate. Sometimes you, I gotta I gotta learn things in my slow way, and discover things. Even if you tell me, sometimes it doesn't stick in my head as much as if I discover it myself. Wow, that was nice. So if we access security. Well, we should be, uh, we, we have hacker, this should be free. Hack drones, initiate purge. Maybe it doesn't make it free. Each level of the skill reduces multi-tool cost of hacking reduction depends on the di task difficulty. Uh, I don't know. I'll try, next time I look at a drone, I'll see what um, re like disabling it costs, like right now. Okay, so disabling it is free. But we don't want to disable it. We want to be able to hack them. So we want two more hacker, uh, two, yeah, two more levels in hacker. And then uh, we should be able to um, basically start our own little drone army. That'll be fun. That'll certainly make me enjoy the technician more. The thing is, though, is that um, robots are a temporary thing. Like, later later and later, we don't really get opportunities for hacking drones. That's, I guess, when we want to start making our own, right? Okay, that guy was going to do some major damage to me. Let's go ahead and get rid of all these barrels. Would be really I wonder how difficult it is to get rid of this kind of drone. Costs 1 to disable it. All right, let's do that just this one time. Nice. Um, okay, so... We want, we need to be level six. Okay, so I'm just gonna take hacker two. This is gonna start, uh, you know, we're, we're gonna start making some interesting plays with this. Basically all drones are now on offer in turn, well, I can I can hack, wonder how the crowbar compares to the, the knife. Let me see here real quick. Ah, crowbar does better impact. Has longer swap time though. And the combat knife has melee guard. That's okay. We shouldn't worry about swap time because we're most of the time we're going to be swapping to the um, the crowbar. We're going to be within smoke, 
So we're going to have a little bit of grace, I think. Uh, but yeah, basically, we're going to be able to hack the, like, spider drones for, f like, we can disable them for free, and, yeah, all right, and we can hack the flying drones um, for free, meaning we can, we can have them on our side. We can also do stuff like this. Reveal map, tracking data. So we get, we get stuff like that for free now, which is nice. This, uh, you know, offers us some interesting tactical advantages. Oh, we, I made the classic mistake of having my melee weapon out. Okay, we're gonna have to heal up. Ugh. Okay, so we could do something. I, I don't know if maybe. Oh, we can't. We can't fire that far. I'm wondering. I was wondering if maybe we could like grab the attention of those guys by shooting them, but that doesn't seem to be the case. Oh, that didn't show up on the map. Do we have a grenade? Yes, we do. Let's use a grenade. Use. Why Why isn't it using it? <laughs> Is that, oh, maybe that was for a grenade launcher. Oops. Um, we don't even have enough for a smoke screen. That's bad. And this is going to cost us. We died. Oh my god. Even when I have like some kind of strategy, I get taken out. Okay. Well, if you are enjoying the series, definitely hit that like button and consider subscribing for more content like this. And I'll see you guys next time. And I guess I am going to keep trying with the technician since I do actually have some kind of method that works with their build and not just like trying to turn it into a marine or scout build. I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.